Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys don't know me, my name is Leslie and welcome to my channel. Um, before I begin, I do want to apologize if you guys hear any background noise. I am babysitting my little cousin at the moment and I do have the TV on for him and I really wouldn't have had any other chance to record but right now because I've been pretty busy today but I did want to make a video for you guys because this is going to be my 30 week bump date or pregnancy update and it's crazy how the time has been just flying by I have 10 weeks to go that is just crazy it's crazy I have 10 weeks to go um, I'm nervous and excited I'm nervous because I feel like I'm still missing a bunch of stuff from my baby and I'm trying to get everything ready for her and it's um, it's just it, it's crazy <laughs> Um, it's just crazy um, to try not to stress myself that much. Not really stress, but worry about the things that I'm missing for her. And I'm trying to get it as soon as I can. Um, but uh, I am going to start off first with um, the app that I use, uh, which just tells me how baby is doing. And then I'm going to talk about my symptoms and all that fun stuff. And then I'm going to show you guys my um, belly bump. So let's go ahead and get started baby is as big as a zucchini baby's skin is getting wrinklier to make way for all these essentials brain tissues baby's now strong enough to grasp a finger your 15.2 to 16.7 inches 2.5 to 3.8 pounds baby continues to grow so it's pretty crazy how baby's growing and it's kind of exciting to know that baby's strong enough to grasp a finger. So that's pretty cool to know. I still don't know how much baby weighs. I do have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. That's probably when I'm going to be uploading this because I do want to record my sonogram for you guys so you guys can see it. So that would be pretty exciting. Um, but yeah, like I said, I have a doctor's appointment tomorrow. It's not really a doctor's appointment. It's just a sonogram appointment. But I am going to try and record it and show it to you guys. So you guys can hear baby's heartbeat and kind of be updated like I am on baby. Um, but symptoms I've had at 30 weeks is I've been having crazy heartburn, guys. I wake up in the middle of the night having heartburn. It is the worst feeling I've had through this pregnancy is heartburn. I I am I bought a new um, a new thing of Tums, uh, which is supposed to help you um, with the heartburn when you're pregnant. You can't take them when you're pregnant, and I am already almost done with the whole bottle, and that is insane. And you're only supposed you're not supposed to take more than five Tums a day, and I I need more than five Tums, <laughs> and it's that's just at night time. Um, <clears throat> But besides that, I did count babies, uh, how many times baby kicks because I was a little bit worried. And I have noticed baby kicks um, around the, um, 10, 10 times an hour, which is the normal, normal weight that a baby should be kicking in an hour. Um, it was just yesterday, baby did kick only 8 times in an hour, but then like 10, 10 minutes passed from the hour that was supposed to be and then baby did kick like those other two times so I kind of will count it as a baby did count 10 times because it was just a little bit like it was just 10 minutes but baby did um, kick 10 times today um, I am trying to count every day just to make sure and be updated with it um, but besides that oh, my cravings that I've had guys uh, for Mother's Day me and my family had like a barbecue and after I finished eating, uh, finished eating, I really was craving Tres Leches cake. If you guys have ever had that cake, oh, it's so good. And I was craving it. And I couldn't buy it until the next day. And then I did. I only ate half of it. So, saving the, the half of the cake. Because I bought a little small cake. I didn't eat the whole half of the big cake. No, don't take that. Uh, it was just a little small piece of cake. And I just ate half of it. And then I'm saving the half of it. But maybe later on today, if I'm craving it, I started craving a lot of strawberries again. I bought two big old containers of strawberries uh, because I was craving strawberries with chocolate dippings on them. This is the first time I've craved that, so I'm probably going to be doing that today and just have a little bit of them. Um, 
But besides that, I'm still doing my normal walks. I do 30 minutes in the morning and 30 minutes at night. Uh, I have noticed that I am getting a lot tired now when I'm walking, which is really weird to me because I'm, I never get tired when it comes to walking. Um, well, at least before, but now I'm getting pretty tired. Um, but besides that guys, it hasn't been anything else um, with any uh, symptoms or came just a heartburn that's pretty much um, getting crazy. Oh, here comes my little cousin. He brought the tablet over here. You want to be on the video again? He wants me to carry it. <laughs> Sorry, this is probably getting a little bit too loud because he has a tablet over here. So let me just go ahead and show you my belly bump. He's like looking at the camera like, why are you talking to yourself? <laughs> okay, let me go ahead and get up. He's probably going to be sitting here. Uh, let me move this chair on over here. So this is my belly from... The front, the side, the other side. Let me take this down. So, really from the front side. I don't know if it's just me, guys, but I've noticed that my stretch marks have been um, getting like less red. Like, I feel like they were so much more red, and now they're getting a little bit clearer. Like they're getting more on the pink side of it. Maybe it's just me, I don't know. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and comment on my videos. I love when you guys comment on my videos. I feel the love, guys. <laughs> so uh, please subscribe, like, and comment. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hey guys, I wanted to record this video because I know I want. I said that I really wanted to record my sonogram for you guys so you guys can see it. But I had total pregnancy brain and I mixed the dates. Today was actually just a normal doctor's appointment and in two weeks, <laughs> that's when I have my last sonogram. So I am going to record that one for you guys, but I had total, total pregnancy brain and I completely mixed up the dates. So I am sorry, um, but I do have uh, an appointment on Friday for my 3D sonogram one, which I'm paying out of my own pocket for. Um, so I will vlog that day for you guys so you guys can see it. But I just wanted to apologize because I did mention on my video that I was going to upload the sonogram so you guys can see it. But pregnancy brain, I completely mixed up the dates. But the good thing that they told me the doctors, I ended up, I ended up losing weight without even me trying. I was just trying to maintain my weight, but I ended up losing two pounds. It's not that much, but... At least it's um, what I've been doing has been working, which has been eating a lot healthier and having our walks every day. So, sorry guys, I couldn't record for you guys. Pregnancy brain. Um, but please like, subscribe, and comment. I love you guys. Let us some kiss. Ah. <laughs>